truth is linked in a circular relation with systems of power which produce and sustain it. Every educational system is a political means of maintaining or of modifying the appropriation of discourse with the knowledge and the powers it carries with it. All teaching systems, which appear simply to disseminate knowledge, are made to maintain a certain social class in power. Power is not an institution and not a structure, it is the name that one attributes to a complex strategical situation in a particular society. Where there is power, there is resistance. Schools serve the same social functions as prisons and mental institutions. The fascism in us all that causes us to love power, to desire the very thing that dominates and exploits us, Power is also exerted over the body, not so much as physical punishment, but as ideological orders. Do not ask who I am and do not ask me to remain the same. The perfect disciplinary apparatus would make it possible for a single haze to see everything constantly. The language of psychiatry, which is a monologue by reason, could only have come into existence in such a silence. The individual, with his identity and characteristics, is the product of a relation of power exercised over bodies, multiplicities, movements, desires, forces, Visibility is a trap. Truth is not by nature free, nor error servile, but that its production is thoroughly imbued with relations of power. Are the prisons overpopulated, or is the population overimprisoned? Madness, in its wild, untamable words, proclaims its own meaning. Absurdity destroys the an of the enumeration by making impossible the in where the things enumerated would be divided up. Power is tolerable only on the condition that it masks a substantial part of itself. Knowledge is not for knowing, knowledge is for cutting. Maybe the target nowadays is not to discover what we are, but to refuse what we are. Our society is not one of spectacle, but of surveillance. Unreason is to reason as dazzlement is to daylight. We are in the society of the teacher judge, the doctor judge, the educator judge, the social worker judge. The judges of normality are present everywhere. In our society, art has become something which is related only to objects and not to individuals or to life. We are freer than we think. The real political task in a society is to criticize the workings of institutions that appear to be both neutral and independent. To change something in the minds of people, that's the role of an intellectual. Education may well be the instrument whereby every individual, in a society like our own, 
can gain access to any kind of discourse. What desire can be contrary to nature since it was given to man by nature itself? One must confront what one is thinking and saying with what one is doing, what one is. Search for what is good and strong and beautiful in your society and elaborate from there. Knowledge is governed not by a theory of knowledge, but by a theory of discursive practice.